Hey guys, it's Calvin, also known as Roman, and this is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time and the Return to Hyrule. Last time I, I like kind of like was very put off by this whole place uh, because of the, the lack of kind of like definite music. Um, we also got double the hearts, and I think it is kind of like double the hearts because we have double the... I guess we use... Oh, this is totally lens. This is totally a lens of truth situation. Um, and, Din, and Din's Fire. We might as well take out Din's Fire right now. But yeah, it was... um. Oh, is it? Oh, maybe it's not actually. It's not. I don't think it is actually. I was lying. I was lying. It's not a lens of truth at all. But it is Din's Fire because we're going to need it to open up this whole thing. The lack of like, I think just the lack of like definite music is like just really scary to me. And then we, oh, okay. See, I didn't even see the actual platform up there. Okay, so let's go. Let's go. Let's keep doing this. I think, I think we can do a lot. Oh, this is, this is a hover boots. Man, I, I think that like the hover boots are actually one of the best items in the game. Like they're obviously, obviously like, you know, just like many items in Zelda games, they're not going to be useful for absolutely everything. Uh, but I never thought that was the point of them. How do I get this item though? That was a, that was a, that was a bad decision. That was a bad decision too. Let's wait for this to go. Here we go. Okay, I need to, I need to be going like, I need to be going like full force. Before I do anything. Um, I suppose I could just like literally bomb this guy now. That sound is back, which is really weird. Will that do it? See, the problem is with like again, I like I don't think you need the hover boots to do exactly everything in, the, in this part of the game. But it is, I think. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, Link, don't be overreacting. Jesus Christ, Link, always overreacting like a goddamn idiot. And then we step on this, which will... Do what? I think, I think we know, oh, see, look, look over there, I didn't even know that was a thing. Did we do oh, we got that one we okay oh so maybe that's what that's what it did it like activated that platform and then we can move over to this oh I made a mistake okay we can do this again we can do this again um especially now I find this stuff like surprisingly like fun like and I know I know like I know the hover boot sections do peeve a lot of people I don't know I like them a lot is that gonna make it? It is gonna make it. Okay. That was that was a much better, much better try this time. I was talking about it. I want to kind of like expand on what I was talking about last time because I feel like I wasn't being absolutely fair uh, in my way of talking about it. But I think I think you know it's 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 a topic that, like that everyone thinks about is like is it about a game holding up? Uh, is a game should a game be considered good? Uh, for the time, you know that type. Of, you know that type of discussion we have all the time. Is a game good for the? It's like it, it was. It's bad now, but it's good for the time. And like I talked about, how like Ocarina of Time has definitely changed my whole perspective on like that whole idea of like, oh, it's it's good for the time, man. Um, because like I think you look at a game like Ocarina of Time, Tekken Three, Final Fantasy X, even like you know, like older games like Crash Two, and I th I just recently played the, the original Paper Mario on the N sixty four. Like, I'm sorry, but, like, really good games hold, uh, like, stand the test of time. And that's just my personal take. Let's talk to Sari and I'll continue what I was saying. The forest barrier is spelled. Hurry up, Linkle. So I like this as well. I'm going to talk about this as well. I have so much to talk about. So much to talk about. Um, but, uh, yeah, like, I just feel like... I just feel like there's, like, there's good games 
in and again it's all about perspective no one ever knows what the best game is it's always down to you but for me um the greatest games of all time will always be the ones that hold up even now um and also i love that by the way that the all the um that all like the different sages are just like saying like they're kind of like saying quick quips they're not like giving you full speeches because they understand how like dark and like troublesome this oh jesus christ did i did i I don't think there's a, like a specific order though, is there? Okay, we, we, we damaged it. Do I still have the hover boots on like a goddamn idiot? Of course I do. <laughs> me, me hovering about the place. So I remember this room actually much better than a lot of other rooms in this because I remember like getting like being an idiot and like not doing this first. Um, you have to do this to get more space as you're going through this place uh, because it gives you more leeway when you're collecting these uh, silver rupees. Um, I don't I don't really need that heart. I mean, I'd like it. Let's put it like this. It's actually a really cool system. And it's very simple as well because it's one of those puzzles that like, yeah, it's not it's not overly difficult, but it's one of those things that if you, if you don't look, if you don't pay attention to what's around you, uh, like there, right there. Then you're gonna get effed up. It's pretty simple. Like, right there again. This- that was not anything to do with the game effing up. That was literally me not paying attention. And that's what's- that's what I, I do like about Ocarina of Time a lot as well. And I'm gonna talk about the game because, like, my perception of this game has completely changed the second time around. And, like, that happens a lot with me with games, I think, nowadays, even. Like, when- when someone's like, oh, did you like the Dark- like, did you like Dark Souls, uh... I remember it was Dark Souls 3 and I was in college and like, oh, how do you think, what do you think about Dark Souls 3? And I was like, it's really good, but ask me again when I do my second playthrough. And then I was like, oh, this is one of my favorite games of all time. But I can't be like, I can't be the only one who thinks that way when it comes to games. Like, I, I always say like, you know, like, and like, by the way, by the way, I'm not saying that you have to play a game a second time to, to, to figure out if it's good or not. That's, that's a silly statement if I made that. What I'm basically saying is that some games you know, maybe deserve a second playthrough, you know? And I think this is one of those situations. Uh, we have to use a bomb chooser to the top here. I remember this one a lot more than I do... I don't remember the timing, apparently. Now? There we go. I remember this section a lot more because, again, struggling, I will remember. And again, this was not shown on camera the first time I played this game. Um, I don't- I don't remember the, the- the reason I had. Oh my god, okay. Okay, I remember this as well. I came here and I did not get the fire arrow yet. So I was like- I came here and I was like so excited. I was like, oh man, I'm gonna finish this dungeon today. And I came here and I was like, oh my god. I actually have to like- Wait, would you put it this way? I actually have to like, do stuff. Oh, because we have this. No. Makes sense. Makes sense. Don't want my part. I'll probably have to open the door again. But I remember I went here and I was like, I don't even have a fire arrow yet. And I was so freaking upset. I was, I, I like, and, I, and again, it was like so irrational because it's like, 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 it's like, they give you every, like, opportunity to, like, get these, get this stuff. But for some reason I was like, oh, I didn't even get this chest. I'm an idiot. I was like, F this. I was like so upset. Which again is dumb. It was irrational. But then again, a lot of my old Ocarina of Time playthrough is irrational. Uh, we got bomb shoes. Again, this is basically just a hint. Hey, you know, use some bomb shoes here. I wouldn't say I'd still rank Ocarina of Time um, in my. Okay, so do not get that one this time. I still would rank Ocarina of Time. Uh, no, done alright. Oh no, he gets me anyway. He was just dropping. Okay, so it's not that one. Um, I would still rank Ocarina of Time um in the same place that I always would. And again, the thing is, I don't feel the need to rank games all the time. But like, I will be doing a top ten Zelda games, a top ten my favorite, top ten favorite Zelda games, uh, very soon. So I will be ranking them. So like me going, I don't even feel the need to rank them. It's gonna happen. Um, I just feel like you know. If, if I have to, like, if I had to, like, rank all these games, 
Ocarina of Time is still my... Like, and this is a weird thing to say. I would say that it's one of on the lower ranks. And again, it's a situation where you're like... How do I explain it? Uh, it's a situation where, like... Again, I, the, the analogy I always use is... You have 12 donuts on, on a table. They all look freaking amazing. But you're gonna have favored... No! Leave! Leave! Aha! He's gonna come back down and get me, isn't he? As soon as I stop. Okay, get me. Or not? Okay, so of course it was the last one I picked. I don't think I don't think it's a situation where like it, it you have to do every one of those. I think it is a situation where like it's one of them is the right one. Deku nuts, extremely useful when fighting Ganon. I actually figured out when my first playthrough, and apparently it was like an actual method that I didn't actually understand until like I actually did it. Man, I'm so excited to actually, like, fight Ganon, though. It's not gonna- like, again, it's, it's still a decision where I'm thinking, should I, like, do it or not? Like, I'm sure you guys have told me I'm recording this straight after the last one for reasons. Um, the Spirit Barrier is dispelled. Hurry up, kid. It just feels very solemn. It feels very solemn. It feels very weird to be playing this game again. It was completely worth it. Like, going through this whole game has been- and I, I'm very reminiscent now because this happens at the end of all my playthroughs where I talk about, like, what happened before. But it is very reminiscent. Oh, like, I'm very, like, um, nostalgic, even. So we went to... I'm going in... I think I'm going in order of, like... Yeah, I think I'm going in order of, like, the temples that you do. So that... I would go to that last, because I think that would be, like... The, like, that's clearly, like, what meant to be the last one. But then again, there's not... Okay, so water next. Let's go water. And this is just gonna make me think of the Rudos, because, again, my favorite single, like... Like, civilization and culture in all of Zelda... Oh! Oh, we're gonna have to do, like, a puzzle, aren't we? Oh, get rid of these guys as quick as possible. Nuisances. It's really, like, again... Oh, because we got recovery heart. I'm worried about the other... Oh, we have to use a fairy. Okay, that's fine. That, it's it's grand. We can like we we're literally not gonna be like fighting Ganon until like you know a, a couple of weeks anyway. So not a couple of weeks, a couple of days anyway. So like it's not like it's a big deal. Uh, let's do this. I'm actually gonna be safe since we're going through this. Like and, and I and I said water, but clearly it's the ice, like the ice cavern. Whoa, frame rate. If anyone knows, like, if that's actually a more intensive thing, like, melting, the melting of the ice. Okay, okay. So if we push that into there. No, I think I made a mistake already. Let's go out. Mm -hmm. I think it'll be push this to here. Then push that into there. Then push this to here. See, the time limit is kind of weird, right? Oh shit, wrong way to do this. Oh no, no, I got it exactly right, but there's another- Oh, the door's up there, okay, so, I- I get it. And I'm glad I brought the fire. See, this is where the, like, the Zelda experience is coming in, right? <laughs> like, I'm starting to realize- No, Calvin, go back and bring some fire. Prepare for this, prepare for that. This is rusted. We need a Megaton Hammer. 
Man, I don't know what it is. The, the lack of, like, you know, like, bright... Or, like, the lack of, like, a dungeon... Like, a specific dungeon theme. I understand there is a theme. I'm not... Like, I'm not deaf. Uh... Like, it kind of, like... I'm feeling it, is what I'm saying. And it feels really weird. It feels really dark. It feels like there's something constantly watching me. It feels like I have to be quiet. And I've said this numerous times, but it's a really weird feeling. Okay, we have a... We have another light arrow. Oh, there she is. There's my wife. The water barrier's dispelled. Hurry up. I just realized how close I was to the microphone this whole time. <laughs> I didn't even realize. I was like, I looked down with my eyes and I was like, oh, there it is. There is the microphone. So, we did... We have four done so far. And I believe there are six, right? So we have... We did... Well, over here would be... Well, we, we didn't... Oh, we didn't do fire, did we? No, we did a different one, didn't we? Yeah. So next is fire. Oh my god. Wait, wait. I remember this very clearly. We need to put on the, the red, the red, the red. It's nice. It's nice to change the outfit every once in a while. I know, I know some people probably like, why do you have the freaking blue on? I wonder if it would be beneficial. Shit. Okay. Okay, I got this. I got this. I got this. I wonder... Yeah, I wonder if it'd be, it'd be beneficial to put on the hover boots. Again, I don't think it's going to be... I don't think it's 100% needed. But I would like to. Wait, is this not lowering? Okay. <laughs> I'll play ball. There is one behind here. Okay. Oh shit! I oh my god! It only damaged me like a tiny bit. Um. I believe this is a place. Yeah, it's over here. Okay. I have to lift this up. It is cool because it is challenge. It is like you know. I know some people feel like it's an artificial challenge, adding a time limit to things. Um, you know, in some cases. But man, like, I don't know, I can't, I, I'm kind of into it. <laughs> I'm definitely kind of into it. I mean, it like, not that, not that it's like a specific time limit, but you know what I'm saying. Okay, this is one over here. Oh god. Oh no, I'm gonna have to start from the start, aren't I? Yep, okay, let's do this. I remember, I, like, you don't even understand, guys. I remember this place for some reason. I, rem I don't know why I remember some specific places about this whole dungeon. Like, I didn't remember the ice cavern that much at all. Um, but for some reason I remember... Oh, fuck it, let's just get it. Let's just get it. Like, at, th at this point, like, we're not taking, like, damage at all. Well, we are taking damage, but you know what I'm saying. Way less than we would be. And then after this, we would just have the spirit one, wouldn't we? I have to think. Again, I remember, for some reason, I have in my- again, like, again, this one, this one, and the, um... Well, this one mainly. <laughs> this one mainly. Uh, a few other ones as well, I think I remember, uh, quite clearly. Uh... Why can't- why can't I- Oh, okay, okay, okay. But for some reason, like, again, picking up that silver rupee seems to be, like, I, I thought that, like, I remember, like, in, I, uh, like not picking up one of them. And I was thinking, oh, maybe I don't have to pick up the one that's closest to me. Uh, well, clearly that's not the case. Uh, so maybe we just have to collect them all at once and, like, just do it in the right order. Because it seems, like, that platform is falling and, like, it does, I think if I fall into the lava, it doesn't matter as long as the door opens. Like, the door stays open. So maybe we'll do that first. 
The hover boots are helping though. The hover boots are helping me. I gotta just make sure there's no other ones in here as well. Yeah, I think we're gonna do fine. I think we're gonna do fine. Wait, so... Again, I fell in again, but I don't think they're gonna make us do it again. No, yeah, the door just opens. So yeah, I was doing it in the wrong order. I was I, I thought that like maybe I had to leave it there, but no, there's definitely there's definitely an order to things. Uh I'm gonna hop over here and see if I can get it from here. Where is good old hookshot? You know it's a good day when you get to use the hookshot. But that means that's just one more after this, and then we could actually, like, we could kill Ganon today. And I think, I think that's what's gonna happen, guys. I think I'm probably just gonna go for Ganon. Um, I think now with the double hearts, especially since I did it the first... I did, I did my first playthrough of this with... With, like, two hearts, and, <laughs> like, fighting Ganon with two hearts. So, like, I think that I can... I think I can beat Ganon this time way easier than I did before. And especially now with like, after playing so many Zelda games, I feel like I can do it a little bit better now than I did before. So we have one more, which is over here. Let's try and do it. Let's try and do it in the time in the, in, in the time I have left in this video. Um, I usually don't double upload Ocarina of Time, but we're so close to the end that we might actually get a triple upload of Ocarina of Time. <laughs> I mean, we're so close. We're so close to the end. Right? Why not? This is a lens of truth. Situation. Can I big orange sword you? This is just torture for him. Um. Turn around. You gonna come? Big, big orange sword. Okay, we got a chest, but I'm worried about the smaller chests. As much as it makes- as much as I definitely want to like- I have this craving to open up and- to like- to like... Open up all these things, I'm not sure if I should. Okay, let's open up one. It's probably a trap. Yes, of course. Of course it's a trap. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go. I'm not gonna like- I'm not gonna chance all this. Wait, I saw Zelda's little- okay. Okay, yeah, it's a glitch. It's a glitch. Did I actually do something? Of course it did. Give me a chest. I thought it was gonna be in the other room for some reason. Man, I'm so- I don't know, I just got this burst of energy. I don't know, I'm so excited to, to like, to, to like, see the ending of this game again. Because I remember, I remember the cr Oh, God. Okay, let's do this. Um, oh, why do I still have the hover boots on? You guys would never forgive me if I, like, did not take these off. <laughs> I know for a fact. Well, you know, maybe you'd forgive me, but... Uh, it's a bit of a... It's a bit of a weird time. A bit of a weird time in here because, again, I don't want to get hit by a bunch of boulders. Oh, no, 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 please don't! Oh, shit. Like, if you could... Like, could you just move? Could you just move, please? Thanks, you're so nice. And I think there's only one more in here, right? 
But we are under a time limit, so we have to we have to we have to worry a bit. Uh where's the last one? Right here. No no link, you can do it, you can do it. There we go. Good. Okay, I got slapped around the place. Out Okay, now it just seems like the balls are human and they know what they're doing. <laughs> like Oh, I remember this. I remember this. Don't even try and trick me. And there we go. We actually have um, all of these seals destroyed. So at this point, we can actually head on. And there is the man himself. The light barrier is dispelled. Hurry. It is kind of crazy, like, the kind of, like, um control that is being brought back to the castle for us and at this point now we can actually I think now we can get through I don't know if I missed the door we're gonna find out if I did or not yeah guys thank you for watching I think this might be the second last episode um since the like it, the save file takes you back to beforehand anyway if I wanted to go off and get the extra stuff and just like finish it out and get the extra hearts it's a definite possibility. I'm not very good at like doing side quests after the fact. I've been trying my best, especially with stuff like Super Paper Mario. Uh, but we'll see how it goes, guys. Let's let's do a little thing we don't usually do.